Within our burn plant, we have a prescription that the temperature can only be so so high, the wind speed can only be so high, the humidity can only be so high, and that is, and that's for safety. So everybody stays safe. With the burn plan, you write down what you're going to do. Have a prescribed fire to get rid of cedar trees. Where you list the land description of where you're going to have it, when, how. It's definitely more than the back of an envelope. It's about a 20-page burn plan. Okay. Um, and there's a lot that goes into it. Rod is going to go over here and he's going to watch to make sure the fire doesn't jump this black line. You're going to be over here making sure whatever. And it tells you exactly what you're going to do and what you're expected to do and when you're going to do it. It'll list which black line you start first, which way the fire is going to go, you're going to stop it at this ridge, you're going to do whatever. It just lays out a complete plan of what your fire it for that day is. You know, if a rancher does want to do a prescribed burn, it is about a year's worth of planning to get it done. Sarah and I sat down and uh, we, we went through a whole bunch of scenarios about what would we do if this did, if the fire did this or if it did that. It's about three to, you know, at minimum three to four field visits, we GPS the area. We need to know, we need to figure out our escape routes, our ignition plan, where gates are, where water facilities are, what kind of wind we're gonna look at that day. If there's any hazard spots, you know, you know, somebody's house or other corrals, you know, just, there's just, there's a enormous amount of planning that goes into a prescribed burn. So yeah, you gotta go through that and you got to have a plan, a prescription, and pretty much follow it if you can, if it's at all possible. It's a slow process. We've got to change people's mindset of not being scared of fire. Respect it. Know what you're doing. But it it can work. It takes away a lot of that fear factor. Okay, so this is this is a group thing, mm -hmm. and so when you've got that organization around you, exactly. Okay, exactly. Got it.